Hey, what's going on out there? It's Sean Devine, and today I have a very quick tutorial for the Logic Pro X users. This is dealing with the note repeat feature, which was not that obvious uh, in the last update in terms of how to access it and uh, how to actually open up the menu itself. So I'm going to show you how to do that and also show you a practical use for it in programming hi-hats. So the first thing is, uh, how do you get to it? You're going to need to go to your key commands. And you'll hit edit. And over here in this search, you're going to type note repeat. So you'll see it comes up and mine is programmed as shift command return. And you can put it to, to whatever you want to do there. Uh, but so if I hit uh, shift command return, it will pull up this window right here. And so let's just go through the window real quick. I'll explain what all this stuff is. Let's close the key remote for now, but this rate, what this is, is this is the, the value of the note repeat. So you got 16 notes, triplets, all the way up to uh, uh, 256. So you can do some really quick program stuff in there. Right now I have it controlled via the modulation wheel. And I also have a max and min value here. What this means is that at the minimum for the modulation wheel, we're going to be at 16 notes. At the maximum, it will go to 128. Now you can also do uh, triplet and dotted notes that will uh, show up in our rates. So if I uncheck that, it'll just go through our whole notes. And we got triplets. And if I want to do dotted instead of triplets, we can do that as well. So then if I click this key remote, section right here this is going to open up our keyboard and what I can do is now I can actually change the values based upon what note I hit on my MIDI keyboard so this is useful if you want to uh, to do that so let's go ahead and I'm just going to program a basic uh, kick snare pattern and then we'll use the note repeat on the hi-hat Now let's reopen up our note repeat window. And so now what uh, should happen here is if I turn my mod wheel and I hit the, the hi-hat, we're gonna be at 16th note by default. Okay, and so now as I move it up, got triplets, 32nd note, 32nd triplet, 164th, and so on, all the way up to 128. So now let me show you how this can be uh, really useful and make programming some of the, the trap kind of hi-hats a little bit easier. So you get the idea. I mean, you can throw in triplets and do some really quick uh, pr uh, programming there on the notes themselves. So hopefully this is helpful. You all try it out in your own productions. If you have any uh, questions or comments, feel free to leave them below. And as always, appreciate the likes and subscribes. We'll talk to you soon.